Okay, for the IMSA Michelin Pilot Challenge Series Finale for 2019, Road Atlanta, Brazelton, Georgia, 12 corners, two and a half miles, a little bit over, but let's call it two and a half among friends, shall we? By the time you've taken the racing line, you've probably knocked a couple of things in a race. It's going to be a hot pace. It's going to be an exciting race. I mean, it, it is absolutely wide open. Great to see that Aston Martin on the pole position. What a good job Akil Rabindra did. Just his fourth start in this championship. One of the Aston Martin young drivers is certainly living up to that reputation. But for the team, there's a lot of a lot riding on this for the team because they've been in really, really good positions in many of the races this season. It's all kind of gone wrong either in strategy or during the pit stop. So there's, there's a little extra pressure, I think, down there in the automatic racing pit lane. For potentially your career progressing. And 120 minutes, the Fox Factory, 120 with Akil Rabindra on driver's right in the white Aston Martin Vantage. When does he press the loud pedal? Answer now! And Prio tries to go with him and he's going to defend on the inside. It looks like Owen Trinkler's got the best run from the second row and goes down the inside. He'll go up to second. Prio muscled it. And now, then that car, the 39 car, is unleashed. The starting driver was telling me earlier on, Tyler McCurry, he's only doing it. And that's it, number 39 Audi. And now uh, it's on race with Charlotte. Keith, Alessandro and the rest of the team, thank you very much indeed for all your hard work this year. Well, it's been a very good start for Akil Rubinja and Owen Trinkler has gone through the defending champions, their last race, and just to make sure that it's okay. Now we're here. Across the line, Akil Rubinja. What's wrong here, hasn't it, for uh, Carbon? I mean, they kind of put themselves by, behind the eight ball, I think, by, by doing very few laps in practice. They really didn't dial the car in to the ultimate effect, I don't think, during those practice sessions. So Jeff Westfall, when he went out for qualifying, he wasn't completely happy with the car. He hadn't done that many laps. And I think by his own admission, he left a couple of tents on the table. And that puts you vulnerable. I mean, that car's been qualifying on the front row 52. That's a really good story. No, 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 no. It was, it was all they could do to get it out there. Really good job.